this short video will show you how to connect a new Unity project with Plastic SEM. After creating your brand new Unity project, open the Edit Project Settings Editor panel. That's where you can find the version control preferences. Choose Plastic SEM as the version control drop down menu. Here you will need to specify some information to let the Plastic SEM client connect with the Plastic SEM server. Repository name will be used to specify the name of the Plastic SCM repository you are going to be using. If you write a repository name that doesn't exist, the plugin will create it for you. A Plastic SCM repository is a database where all the revisions, changes, branches, labels, and many more objects are stored. Workspace name will be the name for the local Plastic SEM workspace where your Unity project has been created. A Plastic SEM workspace is a working copy of the Plastic SEM repository used to create changes and deliver them to the repository by using the check-in operation. The last parameter is the glue on mode. Plastic SEM supports two different workflows, one for developers and one for artists. The artist one is called glue on and you can learn more about it from our website. If this is your first time setting up Unity and Plastic, I recommend you to set this mode to false. After completing all the information, you can click the connect button. The status will display connected once the repository and the workspace are created. Now you are ready to start adding content to the repository. Open the window version control view and you will find that Unity has, has automatically added the project settings to the repository. Right click the root list item and click submit to run a check-in for those files. Write a small comment describing the content you are submitting. Once you have it, click submit and you will have your first change set created.